Good afternoon, everyone, and welcome to another edition of the Android News Byte. If you've ever looked for a free and open source email application for Android, then you've likely heard of K9 Mail. While many have probably also searched for a Thunderbird app on Android, this has actually been in the works since 2018. But then, two years ago, it had been revealed that K9 Mail had been taken over by MZLA Technologies, which is a subsidiary of the Mozilla Foundation. It was then announced that K9 Mail would be rebranded to Thunderbird, but they had never given a firm release date for the project. That time has come though, and the first beta release of Thunderbird for Android is now available to the public. Anyone who is currently using K9 Mail will eventually get a rebranding update to Thunderbird, but it's unclear when that will happen. So if you want to test out Thunderbird right now, you'll need to download it from this GitHub page. And I'll be sure to include this link in the video description below as well as the pinned comment here so that it's easy for everyone to find. Looking through this changelog, we can see that the team has added material you design elements throughout the application. They've updated the color scheme, allowed for migrating your settings from K9 Mail, and they've added some basic funding options via the Google Play subscription system. To install Thunderbird on Android, simply scroll down to the bottom of this page and look for the APK file right here. After it has been downloaded, you can open up the file and follow through with the side loading process. Once done, you'll see the new Thunderbird beta icon on your home screen or in your app drawer. After you open it up, you'll enter your email address and then sign in to allow Thunderbird access to the data. The process is quite smooth if you're using a Gmail account as well. You can choose how frequently you want Thunderbird beta to check for new emails, which can be set up to check every 15 minutes, every 30 minutes, or every 1, 2, 3, 6, 12, or 24 hours. This can even be set to never so that you will manually pull in your emails when you want. Your labels from Gmail are imported and accessible from the navigation menu on the side here. And the app looks rather nice as well, especially for a free and open source email client. Now, I personally never got into using K9 Mail as my sole email application on Android, so I would be curious to hear from all of you who currently use it. I'd like to know what you think of the new Thunderbird Mail app compared to what you've been using. And for everyone else who is looking for a free and open source email client on Android, I definitely recommend you give Thunderbird a try and then let me know what you think about it down in the comment section below. And please do not forget to like this video while also subscribing to the channel for more Android news like this.